Hello, it's me. Welcome. So uh, today we're going to be hopefully doing a double feature of MMO first impressions. Um, well, we'll see how I'm feeling after I do the the first one here. <laughs> um, as I do have a couple of games on my list. Um, but our first one for today is going to be Legend of Mur, I think. There we go. And now for a little bit of uh, a little bit of background to this game, there are apparently two versions. Um, depending on which server you want to sign up for, I'm honestly a little bit confused about the whole situation. So my apologies. We're going to be playing the Arcadia version. Um, and like, uh, so you know, I I I'm totally like totally fresh to this for the most part. Um, I got set up with an account and everything and I made sure that it worked and that's all I've done. I did take note of the fact that the text in this game is tiny as hell and seeing as I'm nearly blind, quite literally, I've actually turned on my computer's uh, magnifier. So hopefully that will help me to read. And I'm actually thinking I might use this for my Grimrock streams as well, because I've been having issues reading the text on Grimrock. But um, let's not talk about other games. Let's talk about Legend of Mur and let's... Uh... Oh boy, let's just make sure... You know, I should really turn off the thing where I don't let you guys see my, see my mouse seeing as I've been playing a lot of games where the mouse is kind of contextual and important. Uh, let me see if I can actually change that, like, right now, actually. Um, uh, capture cursor. There we go. Now you can see my mouse, which is vaguely important for playing a game that's going to involve lots of clicking on things. So, time for us to create a character. And uh, don't let these don't let don't let these amazing 3D graphics fool you. The game is not 3D once you get into it. Uh, so this game has sort of a gosh, I really need to learn how to actually pronounce this word. Uh wooja, I think. I, I, I took a little bit of Mandarin even, so like I should really, really like actually not suck at saying this word. But it's a sort of a, I just think like Chinese high fantasy. It's, and you'll basically have the right idea. You know, instead of having like wizards and, and uh, wizards and, and warriors, you've got, well, wizards and warriors, but also Taoists. Or Taoist. I, I don't know how people prefer to say that anymore. And uh, a fourth class, which I can't select? Is it maybe... No, it just seems like I can't. Um, I can't really select it. So, uh, one of the things I, I habitually do every time I do one of these MMO streams um, is I check to see what the, like attitude has been in the difference between treating male and female characters right from character creation because that'll tell you a lot about the quality of a game um so we've got our got our warrior dude who's got like an oversized meat cleaver by the looks of it um have our wizard that is some intense colors and our Taoist, and I can't, like, I, I can't even hover over this last one. Like, everything else, a thing comes up, and I assume this is, like, rogue or assassin or something like that, given it's two daggers, but I guess we're not gonna find out today, because I can't actually select that one. <sighs> Taoist is such a weird, like, what is? What is the, is it the cleric, maybe? That, that'd be kind of weird, a warrior and, like, two heavy casters? Uh, so let's check out the the female um, equivalents here. We've we've definitely got a, you know, it's 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 not the worst I've seen by any means. Like I mean, she's mostly covered. I I'm 
I'm impressed by how covered she is. That I'm not impressed by. Also, is it just me or was... Wait a minute. Okay, none of these are animated. They're, they're literally just pictures of 3D models, <laughs> which should really be a major hint of this game. It does not actually run with 3D graphics. Oh, oh, that... I'm sorry, this this kind of pains me. It's it's a lot of cliches for, like, bad character... Like, specifically bad female character design in one. I, I like the weird serration along this bottom portion of her, of her, um... What is that supposed to be? Robe? Skirt? I don't know. The... Appar apparently the, the Taoist is slightly more covered. Slightly. Wait. Okay, it looks like the wizard wears flats, but the Taoist wears heels. What about the warrior? Please, I... I... It looks like the warrior is wearing heels, and that... That just... Ah. Uh, Ah, uh, uh. and if if you're like up there and you're thinking to yourself, Moth, why the hell do you care about whether or not um whether or not your warriors wear heels? Go go fucking put on some heels and then like attend a karate class and like come back when you've twisted both of your ankles anyway. I you know I can't actually tell because like okay just visually speaking we've got sword and cape sword and, like, skirt cape thing. Sword and cape. They all use swords. One-handed swords. So, like, combat-wise, I'm really not certain what the distinction is going to be here. But I... I'm gonna go with the... I'm gonna go with the worst option here. I'm going to play... I'm, I'm gonna play the, 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 the female wizard. I wanna know... Um... I, I wanna know... Just, like, if starting off, my character is going to just be, like, Eviscerate my gut, fiends! Goblins, do you see this massive target of my mid-region? <sighs> Combined with that kind of tee sort of, uh, sort of posture. Alright. Uh, gosh, name. Uh, uh, can I get away with Mothmodia again? Yes, I can. Mothmodia tends to be a very safe sort of a. Uh... Oh, did I did I not actually create character? I accidentally closed. Okay. Yep, we're good. But the, the what what what? Okay, it's making noise like there's a window that I just can't see here. What? Is this game broke as? F How is? It? Okay, may maybe it's maybe it's trying to tell me that the name ugh, my, seventy-seven. Okay, no one's gonna have a create. Sorry? Uh, 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 okay. Now I could click down there. What is going on? You know what? Maybe it's a maybe it's a rendering problem. I'm gonna quickly turn the game into full screen and see if I can like suddenly mysteriously actually see things create. No, no, it's not. I'll enter again. Whoa! Oh, I broke it. Well, this has been a great start. I mean, talk about first impressions. Okay, okay, this is fine. This is fine. This is a okay. All right. <sighs> what?
Well, maybe... Maybe... The actual fuck. Okay. Ugh. One moment. I need to... I need to briefly... Let me just make sure you can't see what I'm doing. Okay. Um, I just need to briefly go back into my email. Okay. New character. Mothmodia 2027. 20, 20, oh, that's fine. Okay. Okay. Look, the, the model, well, oh, shit. <laughs> I accidentally just like punched my microphone. Oh, that was, that was grand of me. I'm like, okay, I'm a little disoriented, not gonna lie. That was um a strange error to hit at the start. So, uh, anyone play Diablo? <laughs> oh boy. Uh, so you could probably immediately understand why, as someone who is nearly, like, legally blind, why I would need to set up a magnifier for this stream. I mean, the pixel art is genuinely very impressive in that sort of... Diablos. Am I naked? Bor Border Patrol Mothmodia 27. Yeah, looks like I'm naked. I just got plus two. I don't know what I got plus two to, but I got plus two. Uh, drugs. I, I, I got fucking drugs? I, I, I'm 100% serious. It says drug. MP drug small and HP drug small. Okay. I've... There, now I have clothing. And a wooden sword. Let's equip that as well. Can I can I I mean okay, that's a good sign. I can see my equipment when it's when it's put on. I don't have to stay naked. I didn't think I was gonna have to. I'm just kinda taking things in. Game shop. And Ener energize. I have a feeling this is awful micro transaction. Well, you know what? Let's find out. If, buy game go okay. What does energize do? Nothing. I wonder if I'm just like wasting all my energize clicks or something like that. Oh, okay. What the fuck is my hair? Huh? Status, okay. State, which is separate from the status, mind you. Do not get your state and your status confused. That would be a horrible misunderstanding that would... Okay. Required level 125. Well, I guess there's quite the, uh, quite the leveling climb in this game, huh? Minimap. This map reminds me of my car- like, I'm having flashbacks to my Carnivores 2 streams, honestly. Got Bordered Village, where's the Ted Tower's House, Ging Ginkgo Tree Valley, which- aren't Ginkgo trees a real thing? I think Ginkgo is a real thing. Woom- Woom- you Woom- Woom- Yon. Woom- Yon. Oma Cave. Which is like, Grandma Cave. What the hell? Maggot Lair! Warrior House! Bish, bish, bishon, b bicon. I I'm always nervous when I don't know like what sort of like phonetics I should be using when I encounter. <laughs> Fucking hell! Wait, is there a local map? <sighs> well, there's the map up there. Okay. E email. Good. Wait, do I have an email? 
Okay, they just call it email. That's that's fine. That's 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 fine. Deal was cancelled. To deal correctly, you must face the other party. Alright. Guild. Extreme PK versus Sabic Wall. Extreme PK versus Phoenix K Okay, explode. Oh, okay. 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 Party. No, that's that's just email. Stall. I can apparently set up a stall and sell things. That's actually kind of a cool feature. I like that feature in games. Even though you basically just go, like, dump your items in the stall and then go AFK, but... Castle ownership and income. Top, top level, 100 and top... DC, to, okay, okay, player rankings, that's cool. Uh, quest? To, to do, talk to Emily for assistance, alright. And finally, options here. Alright. Sounds good. Hello, Mothmodia27, my name is Emily. It's nice to see a new face in town. If you've not already noticed, you have some items in your bag ready to equip. Go ahead and open your inventory and your character screen. Place the items on your character's body. Save save the candle for when it is dark. Click continue when... There's no candle in my inventory. Wooden sword, dress, nothing else. Okay. What was that? You have just completed a quest and gained experience. Move your cursor to the bottom of the screen to view your experience. When your experience reaches 100%, you gain a level. As you progress, it becomes harder and harder to gain experience. Okay. Okay. Uh, killing monsters is key to gaining experience and growing in level. Use the left mouse to button to walk around town. When you see a hen, click on it to begin attacking. What, what the f- Oh, okay. A, a, a new person, Porky, just enters. Uh, when a hen is dead, you can harvest its meat by standing next to it and holding the Alt plus left mouse. To continue, please bring me some chicken. Okay. I'm gonna go kill this chicken. See a Porky. Die. It is dead. I have looted the chicken. Is it in my inventory? Yes, it is. Okay. I can't read that because there's... You gained eight experience in the way. Let's wait for that to go away. Okay. Selling meat from farm animals can help make money to buy potions. You will need to use potions to fight some dangerous monsters in the wilderness. Sell the chicken to Kim. Coordinates? And buy an HP small drug bundle from Larry. Another set of coordinates. Your current coordinates are shown below. Yeah, yeah, no, actually coordinates. Okay, so this game just informs you of coordinates for everything. Uh, I guess that's cool. Yeah, I'm not going to complain. Click continue when you have bought a HP small drug bundle. Okay, give me, give me your drugs. I, I don't even know what's going on. Like... Okay, guard, trap. Sell the chicken to Kim. Buy potion from Larry. Okay. That is what I need to do. Can I run? Okay, now that's just an attack button. Larry. Kim. Okay. 
I can talk to Kim from way over- as, as long as someone is vaguely on your screen. Okay, I just- okay, I, I have eight gold now, that's- that's cool. I don't want to talk to you anymore, Kim. I'm here to kill this hen. I'm just killing random people's farm animals. That's what this game is about, killing random people's farm animals. I don't want to talk to you. I want to kill the hen standing behind you. That was a tough one. Okay. Sell meat. Put the meat there. Sell it. Meat there. Sell. Okay. I now have... 15 gold. Let's go talk to Larry. Buy drugs or... <laughs> Let's go buy drugs from Larry! <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. I I want... Well, oh, here we go. Uh... HP... What am I supposed to get? <laughs> Yeah. HP drug is wasn't it like HP small drug bundle though? HP small drug bundle six coins. That that sounds about right. And I have a small bundle of HP drugs. Yeah. Okay. Um, I have. Let's see, HP small drug bundle, yep. Nice. Uh, you know what, can I just move this? No, I can't. Better weapons will deal more damage. This is true for all, this is true for all items. All item, wait, do, do, okay. This is either not true or my armor gives additional attack power. A, A, C. I don't think that my armor gives additional attack power. You know, I'm I'm looking at this and I have the suspicious feeling that this is not true for all items. Okay. There is a small farm to the west where you will find deer and sheep to harvest for better quality meats. We gotta get the meats. All right. Uh, you can. <laughs> what the fuck am I playing? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me. You know, normally when I do these MMO first impression streams, I get into them and then it's like, you must take the dower rod of Valkyor to the castle of Iverskrand, where you will fight the great general Karlstall in it's like in this game it's like you need to get the meats <laughs> so uh, you can run there by holding down the right mouse button i mean at least i haven't been knocked out yet or otherwise like deprived of my things like there's no build up to say you were this like, important individual, and then you were knocked- like, this bad thing happened, but you were knocked out and unable to do anything, and now you have to go deal with the thing that happened while you were knocked- none- none of that. Wait, there's poison on the ground. Okay? How many- am I not picking these up? Do I, do I not pick them up the same way? Okay. Why why are there why is there poison on the ground? Why is that person invisible? Okay. Required level 10. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. What was I doing? You can run there by holding down the right button and view the mini-map by pressing V once or twice to enlarge, earn enough money, and buy a bronze sword from Travis. Ooh, 
Okay. So I need to... Wait, isn't Travis, like, right there? Bye. Uh, bronze sword. I need 100 gold. All right. All right. All right. B. Where's the farm? I th they said the farm was over there to the wool wet. Okay. Do I go this way? Okay. I think I think it said the farm was to the. Oh, here's a deer. I like how I'm a wizard, but all I've been doing so far is running around and hacking apart animals with my sword. This one's actually fighting back. Interesting deer noises. Like, I genuinely can't decide if I love or hate this game. <laughs> Am I still getting things? I don't think so. Oh, good. Um, what just happened? A new level has been acquired. Okay. I'm level three now, guys. Isn't that exciting? Are you, are you feeling the thrill right now? That I just got a level and there was a swooshing effect and every... Sheep. Why did I just take one damage? I, I get to actually be a mage at level 7, if you were wondering. I mean, it's kind of genre-appropriate, because in Wuxia sort of uh, shows and the like, you know, uh, wizards and the like are typically just individuals who are, like, good at using sword and, like, using their inner key to create magical effects. There, there's not really a huge distinction between someone who's actually, like, a wizard and someone who is just like, I'm so great at martial arts, I I have this special, like, fire sword technique. Or some something like that. I actually, I love Wuxia as, like, a genre. So... There, there are a fair number of, um, there are a fair number of shows that I've personally, that I've personally watched. I mean, I'm, I'm also a fan of the novel version of Romance of the Three Kingdoms, which is like this, you know, the, the like Chinese, like novel, if you will, um. And if you if you've never actually read it, um, it just for a little bit more context, the Dynasty Warriors series is very loosely based on Romance of the Three Kingdoms, but in some ways surprisingly similar in tone. And like there is actually this uh, the sort of um, situation that happens in the in the book where. <sighs> Cao Cao or Cao Cao, I don't remember how that name is supposed to be said. Uh, like goes to goes to a friend's house, and he's like, "I I need warriors for my conquest or something something dumb like that, right?" And so he he wants to talk to his friend in the hope that they'll kind of join in on the conquest and all of that. And the friend says, "Oh well, I, um, let's let's have dinner. Um, I need to I need to go to town. I'll be right back." You know, you can just like wait here in the in the dining hall. So they're sitting there in the dining hall, and they hear the sound of like the of knives being being sharpened. And Sao Sao's like, "Oh fuck, they're gonna, you know, I'm I'm being betrayed. They're gonna they're gonna fucking kill us. This is horrible." And so they they um, Sao Sao and and the few people that he had with him charge into the other room and immediately cut down everyone with knives, only to realize that it was like the the chefs who were preparing to, like, cut up the meat for the meal. And so after everyone's dead, they're like, oh shit, we fucked up. And so they run out of the house, they get on their horses, and they start riding off. And 
halfway they they meet Cao Cao's friend again, who's like, I thought you were going to stay for dinner. I was just on my way back. And they realize that it's like, oh, well, if this guy goes back to his house and realizes that we killed all of his staff, that he's going to not want to be our friend anymore. So they decide to kill him so that they won't have made an enemy. Uh, oh, shit, a yob. Can I kill the yob? Yob destroyed. Okay. Oh. Um, what's this? Give me, give me this thing. I got some sort of item. I auto-equipped, apparently. A precision neck. Accuracy plus one. I have lots of meat. I don't know how much meat I'm really going to need, but I'm going to... A large br brace set? Required level nine. Okay. I don't, I don't know how many of these I'm actually going to need, so I'm just going to continue to... Um, I'm just going to continue to to talk about random silly things while I collect the rest of the meat. But like that that degree of absurdity is kind of like what you get throughout the entire entire novel. Like there there's characters who like, there's a character, I think, who's described as wielding a, a sword that weighed 16 stone. Which, for the for those of you more familiar with non-stone measurements, I think a stone is roughly 14, 14 pounds? 12 or 14. I'm, I'm horrible with numbers. But the point is, like, you know, the sword, uh, this is like fucking Cloud Strife with a buster sword, basically. And, like, another character has, a, like, a 16-foot-long spear, which is less absurd because there were actually, like, pikes and stuff historically that were that long. But it's still, like, it's said in this way that, like, we're meant to be like, whoa, you know, the these people are really heroic. They're using these crazy weapons. It's, it's basically, like proto-anime in, like, ancient Chinese novel form. <laughs> and, like, the video game industry is absolutely kind of obsessed with the- with it. There's- there's tons of, like, Romance of the Three Kingdom, uh, games and stuff like that. Why do these yobs drop so much jewelry? Like, I'm just getting a shit ton of jewelry from these things. Ah, <sighs> I have a gold necklace that gives me plus one agility. And I've got a glass ring that requires a silver, silver bracelet. Glass ring, okay. Well, I mean, I may as well take this stuff. I can probably sell it for more than the meat's worth. I'm leveling up super quickly here, which is a good thing, considering how many levels are in this game, first off, and also the fact that I don't actually get to be a wizard until level 7. I think this bottom bottom left, like, Diablo-style orb of health is, um... I, I assume this is my health. I could just be... It could just be decorative and I'm I'm dying, but I assume that's my health. What a weird starting quest. I mean, gather the ten bear pelts is such a standard sort of thing, but in this case it's literally just get the meat. It's like... Like, maybe I should be weirded out by meat quest here, but I am. Damn it. I keep assuming I have to click and drag, and that is very much so not the case.
I think I had more than enough meat. Why does it sometimes ask me if I want to sell the meat, but not other times? Like, yes, I want to sell the meat. I, I have to, like, do a f one, two, three. One, two. Now it's not asking me. I, I, I should not have to click four times to sell the meat. Is there anything else I can do with the meat? No, it's literally just a quest item. I cannot cook the meat, to my knowledge. The only thing I can do with the meat is sell the meat. I'm happy to sell the meat. I guess Kim is supposed to be like a butcher, maybe? This is inferior chicken meat. Okay, there we go. I have sold all of the meat. Uh, I don't need to buy drugs from Larry. I need to instead walk over here to Travis. And... So Travis just has... Travis just has weapons. S Staff... Of Osiris. Like the Egyptian god? <sighs> I don't even remember what I was supposed to get. Like, I'm, I'm looking at all this stuff. Like, I, I want a dragon sword. Why would I want to get a bronze sword when I can get a dragon sword? Fuck. Alright. I guess I'm getting a bronze sword for 100 gold, because that's what the quest demands of me. Uh... Bye? Okay, better sword. Ah, <sighs> click continue when you have a bronze sword equipped. Alright. I have to wait for the you gained 8 experience to go away. You should hunt some more hostile monsters if you want to get new items or skills. Head further west where the yobs and scarecrows frequent. And look for a book that is suitable to your character. Learn it by double clicking and set a function button to use that skill. Fencing is a passive skill and does not need to be cast. Return to me to continue when you have leveled the skill. The skill. Okay, look, can I sell this wooden sword to you? Yes, I can. Do you want to buy this gold necklace? You cannot sell this item at the shop. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. So, I mean, the pixel art, I, I gotta say, I really do like the pixel art. Like, if you're looking for basically a Diablo experience with more of an Asian flair, then, like, maybe this game is definitely gonna be up your alley. What do we have here? Uh, item storage. Okay. I don't need item storage. I gotta play this game once and then never, never play it again. Anne. Protectors. Okay, here we go. This is where we get the, uh... This is where we get... Other, like, armor and stuff. Uh, base... So source? So that's not how you spell sorcerer. S-O-U-R-C-E-R-E-R. -E -R -E -R. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, Ice Helm, Dragon Hide, Lightning Helm, Magic Robe F, 270 coins. I want to get the Magic Robe F for 270 coins, so we're going to have to save up. Uh, can I sell this? Cannot sell that item here. Okay. I mean, it looks like you can just buy high-level shit from any shop of the specific type. 
Like, I don't think there's anything restricting me from getting high-level gear if I have the money. At this, like, very low-level area. Go on. My character is, like, directionally challenged now? Is it because my mouse went outside of the thing? Why, why can I not leave? Apparently the hen was blocking me. I see. And you know, I never actually did spot where my coordinates were. Oh, there they are. Let's go to the, uh... Let's go to the maggot lair, if we can. Let's see if that's actually like a dungeon. See what we can find. I wonder how big this game actually is. Like, there's a part of me that's starting to... A scarecrow. All right. We are supposed to be killing scarecrows. Oh man, there's multiple scarecrows. Oh shit. I'm gonna use one of my HP drugs. Oh, look, I just got a bronze sword. Come on, can I just, like, pick things up? You get a lot of loot from these things, but it's, like, really hard to see. Like, you basically have to be mousing over the loot in order to actually get the loot. Oh. There we go. That helps. Hexagonal ring. And... One more thing. Iron bracelet. Dog, why are you trying to be so protective of me? There's nothing happening. Well, I got the skill book that I needed. And I got a copper ring, which I can actually equip. So let's go ahead and do that. How is this gold necklace losing durability in my inventory? Oh no, this is a second one. Okay. Oh. I, I, I've never liked equipment durability in games like... Just games like this. Let's kill a yob. Kill this other yob. I, I mean, I, I want to be able to cast a fireball. That's like my goal right now, is I just want to be able... I just want to be able to cast a fireball. Cat. Or rather dog. Other animal that is domestic. One of the cats is, like, freaking out, apparently, and it's causing the dog to become very concerned. Now the cat needs to be loud, apparently. Alright, I'm getting distracted. And another fireball, okay. <sighs> Sheep. Unworthy of my challenge. Oh shit, there's a lot of enemies out here. Fuck! I'm getting surrounded! <laughs> okay, I can do this. If not, then finding out what happens when I die will also be very interesting. I just have to kite them. Let's go this way. I mean, my health is doing perfectly fine right now. So let's kill this last scarecrow. Oh. 
gonna use one of my HP drugs. Keep fighting. Got to level 7. I'm gonna have a ton of treasure to pick up. Picking up treasure is such a hassle in this game. Okay, HP drug. Yeah, so I'm, I'm guessing, like, I can't really say this for certain, but I'm guessing that the, that the Taoist is like the divine caster then. Click, 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 click. Okay, here we go. Copper ring. So let's, uh... Yeah, healing is for the Taoists, so... Taoists are basically just clerics. Got it. Fireball. Um... How do I use... Read a book. There we go. Oh, and now I have a health and a, and a mana... thing. I could equip this silver... I can- I think I can equip both of these bracelets, maybe? Hmm. I'm not sure what some of these things are, like MC and DC. I'm not super 100% on. Ah, oh, cat, must you be so... Must you be so very, very loud over there doing your little cat things? Okay. So I now have a skill bar. I can, in theory, place fire. Let's put it in F1. Okay. Let's find something that wants to die. Let's be. Let's be the. Let's be the wizard I've always been. I've always dreamed of being. Sheep. Grand. This doesn't really seem to be expending very much of my of my mana. I can't really tell if it's better than just hitting it with a sword. Can no longer get the meats, it seems. I mean, it is cool to actually have a ranged attack now. I really don't understand some of the design elements of this game, like... You don't actually need to hold alt to loot... ever, it seems. Except for, like, that beginning quest. Okay. Let's go back to town. There's, there's also, there's no music! I just now realized there's no music, and, like, this game could seriously benefit from some nifty, like, Eru, like, traditional Chinese, uh, like, orchestral stuff going on in the background. Because, like, as it is, it's just like, ah, sheep noise, ah. 
I know is a fantastic rendition of sheep noises. Okay. What I want to do is I want to sell you that. That. I don't think I can sell the skill books to anyone. Can I sell rings? Cannot sell... Okay, cannot sell jewelry type items. What about bracelets? Okay. Well, this one I should equip, actually. So let's equip the glove. So I can't, I can't actually sell any of these things. I have 249 gold. That's not quite enough to get the thing that I want to get. I, I want to get the I want to get the magic robe F. And then I want to go to I, I want to go kind of explore uh, one of the caves or actually I should go and talk to Emily. Shouldn't I? Shouldn't I? I have leveled the skill. Okay. It's about time you got a new armor and helmet. Hunt the hooking, hunt the hooking and raking rat cat. What? Hunt the hooking and raking cats over by the west coast. Find a light armor and magic helmet. These monsters are a little more dangerous than the farm animals, so keep an eye on your health and use a potion if necessary. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? We can we can do this. We can do this. I don't think this should be difficult. Um, no reason to be in here. Okay. What was that? Like all of the all of the hens just got like bit crushed to hell. Robo hens, apparently. The, the hens are starting to sound demonic, and it's really concerning to me. But only when I very first come out of, um, very first come out of a new, new area, it sounds like. Okay, can I go... Can I go in here? It seems like I can go in most of the buildings, which is actually very cool. Buy... I cannot sell books. Okay. Sad? Is that a player? You are too young for this quest. Come back when you are level 42. Okay. Like, again, the pixel art is really, really good. I, I would I would say nothing but positive things about the about like the pixel art for this game. It's absolutely like beautiful. Even the interior environments are very, very well done. Well, it really does not seem like I can do anything with a lot of this stuff that I've picked up. Just gonna, I'm just gonna drop it. Okay. So I was told that along the west coast we would find the... What was it? The raking? 
in the hooking and raking cats? I think this is the west coast. Oh, I guess I have to, this is more like the south coast. Okay. The world is not as big as I thought it was from the, um, at least, uh, not the, um, not, not the zone. I'm, I'm, I'm sure there, there are other zones. They probably, like, you need to go up there, or over there. Yob. We can kill a yob. Like, I don't really know how much, m what, what more I can really do with, with this game. Like, I, I kind of just want to, like, get some new armor. Explore one of the caves, and that'll really be it. I mean, this is basically an MMO Diablo like style. Well, you know, honestly, it's somewhere between it's somewhere between Diablo and early RuneScape, honestly. Can I stop like aggressively missing? P drug, HP drug. Like I'll take the drugs, but I'm not. I'm not gonna pick up any more rings and stuff because I can't sell them. Like how how long have I how long have I been playing this game? Let's as soon as I'm as soon as I'm out of this fight, I'll I'll check my um. OBS, how long? Uh, you know, the better part of, uh, of an hour. Okay. Okay. See, so, yeah, I, I think that that's some good, like, final... Final, uh, goals here. Get, get new armor. Investigate dungeon. Maybe die just to see what happens. But I think I'm pretty much done, like... There doesn't really seem to be much more to do other than run around and kill monsters and probably do quests where you run around and... Oh, here's a hooking cat. Which... A... I guess it's supposed to be like a lion person? Okay. The uh the enemy designs in this game are really uh something else. <laughs> I don't know what they are, but they're something else. But I mean, I don't know, maybe maybe like I, I was I was gonna try to give some justification for the Yob's design, but like there really isn't any that I can think of. Just casually walk. Look for more cats. Fireball things as necessary. I mean I'm level nine now, that's cool. Do I have maybe some things that I could only equip at level 9? This is required level 2, so it's probably trash. I'm just going to assume that if it has a level requirement of like 7 or 9, then it's going to be better than like a level 2 or 3 things. I haven't really gotten anything exciting. Like, I, fi I find one hooking cat. And now it's just like... What is... 
so glad that there's monkey noises. Atmospheric monkey screeching is very important to really get the feel of a game. It looks like I automatically get get the gold, though. Like, if you get golden experience, it's just automatically deposited straight into your inventory. You don't have to pick it up. And I don't know if I think that's a grand thing, or if I think that's, like, a very bizarre thing. I haven't really decided quite yet. I'm not finding any more hooking cats. Maybe I... Like, I still have a... Here we go. There's a hooking cat, and there's a raking cat over there. Let's kill that scarecrow just because I can. Okay, uh well there's a there's an MP drug that I don't need. Oh. Light armor. But it's Light Armor M. I have a feeling I cannot equip the Light Armor M. I could be wrong. Spirit Sword. Okay, let's see here. What, did I, what all did I get? Um, well, I need to be level 11 to equip the Light Armor anyway. Did I not pick up the Spirit Sword? Oh, it's a- it's a book. I see, I see. Well, I mean, on the bright side, at least I- I can level up by fireballing these hooking cats. There's the light armor F. Just gonna randomly cast spells and directions that don't have enemies. The raking cat literally has a rake. I just realized that. It is armed with- I'm killing like peasant cat people. I don't feel heroic doing this. Like, these poor cat creatures, they just want to farm. And I'm like, hey, have you considered being hit by fireballs? I mean, I should be able to sell this this light armor, though, for a decent amount. I hope. Don't mind me, I'm just here to exterminate your kind. Interesting that they're dropping the Spirit Sword books, but they don't seem to be dropping any other class books. Cause like I probably am due for getting my next uh my next mage ability. Let's find out. <sighs> Repulsion, level twelve. Okay. Like if you like if you like the Diablo style like grind I could see how you could definitely get into this game. Please tell me I'm getting close to level 11. Just just please tell me I'm getting close.
Yo, is this like the cat fortress? I want to investigate. Oh, I can't go that way actually. All right. Oh shit, we're in an entirely new zone. Like, everything changed in an... Can I, can I... It, it doesn't give me a bigger map of this region. <sighs> you know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go back. Oh, I, I can't? Yes, I can. So I guess, uh, confirmed, there are other regions. You're not stuck in, in raking cat hell, which I didn't think you actually would be or anything like that, obviously, but... Could you, could you imagine a game like this where there's only one zone? Like, how horrible of a game would that be? Like, you're level 125, you're still getting raking, like, fighting off the raking cats and stuff, and it's just like, please kill me. I mean, the raking cats themselves are actually much higher level than I am. So they've got to be worth decent experience, I hope. Eight, apparently. Where is my experience counter? Like they said the they said that there was one, but I don't see it anywhere. Also, wasn't I supposed to get a magical helmet? Cat trying to sneak up on me. It's it's weirdly turn based. Like you you can see that the enemies they're like moving one tile at a time basically. Why can I do this? There's no reason for me to ever do this. Okay. Oh good. I'm finally level 11. Do you know what that means? Oh, and there's the magical helmet. And an iron sword. Well, aren't we just getting all of the good stuff? What do I need for the iron sword? Okay, I can use it. So, iron sword equipped. It's kind of a gladius. It's weirdly Roman styled. Can I equip the male armor? No, I cannot. You actually- the, the, the clothing? Very much so. Oh, yes. What is that? What is that? Oh, dear god. Oh, like, uh, let me show you my sexy leg. <laughs> It looks like a fucking, like, prom dress. Oh my god. <laughs> this doesn't look like armor. <laughs> oh my god. This is the... I don't know if I think this is the funniest fucking thing or the worst fucking thing, honestly. Okay, that was... Uh, it was it was worth it. All right. It was, it was worth it. We got... We are now prom dress wearing mage lady with a gladiator. Oh, I think I've had enough of this game. I can I fall into this pit and wait? I I need to die. I said that I was gonna die. Forest yeti. You know what? Kill me, forest yeti. Kill my prom dress wearing self. Is 
It's it's not. This visual speaks for itself. How long do you think this is gonna fucking take? Oh, finally! Alright, you know what? While this is happening, I'm gonna have myself a snack and get myself ready for the next stream of today. So I'm gonna mute. So I guess that's all that happens. I've had enough of this game. I will, um... I will see you momentarily with the second game of today. I'm just going to finish up my snack here and uh, get all of the streaming information uh, set up. And I will be back shortly. I will see you then. God damn.